What's going on YouTube? Sir Cole the Meek here, back with some more top lane gameplay. Today we're doing Trundle into Alawi, or I guess I should say uh, Alawi picked into me. That's fine. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna run a Dorn's Blade just because, I don't know, I feel like I can. I, Dorn's Shield's probably safer, but it is what it is. Our team, we got a Kane, Ari, Ezreal, and Seraphine. Their team's got a Rengar, Kale, Smolder, and Janna. Uh, Honestly, I haven't put too much thought into it, but it seems like maybe their late is better with the Smolder and the Kale, probably, and the Alawi as well. Um, but we're just going to keep trying to do the split push thing. Um, group up for some skirmishes in the mid game, and hopefully things go well. This lane matchup, not the worst, definitely not before 6, but at pretty much any point, the whole thing with when you're facing a Lowey is she needs to hit her E. If she doesn't hit the E and she doesn't pull your spirit out, she can't really do much. And it's in those windows when you bait her E and you make her miss it, you need to immediately go for, for a trade. Um, especially post six, if you make her miss her E and you run after her and start fighting her, you can bait out her ult and then run away to safety and then you can go back in with your ult afterwards um if she has no ult she's way less scary if she has no e she's not scary at all looks like she keeps autoing the wave so i'm just gonna take an extra five g's if you ever can take the tentacles it's an extra five gold four of them are somebody's got to fix that hitbox that and aatrox q have pretty dreadful hitboxes and what I mean by that is, if you are visibly outside of the hitbox, you will still get hit by it. I think Kane might be planning to go red Kane. Which I'm just fine with. Seen a lot of blue Kanes this season, and I still think red Kane is better. <clears throat> it's tankier, more sustained. Um, doesn't get completely blown up. Blue Kane needs to get pretty far ahead in order to actually do things or scale a little bit, but... Okay, I'm just gonna casually miss that. But will I get the cannon? Yes. I don't know what... She... I haven't been paying enough attention. I think she has W. Yeah, she has W. She can't steal my spirit yet. She can once she gets this. <coughs> One thing I like to do is kind of, you know, you have to stand behind your own minions to not get hit by it. See? Also, if you can, yeah, that was a solid trade. See? No E, no problem. She presses W, but you are standing inside of your frozen domain, so you get some move speed, so you can kite out of the W and not get hit by them. Alright, that was a pretty handy kill for them in bot lane. I'm gonna see if I can make her, uh, maybe slam the wave. Nah, she's not gonna do it. Actually, she might. Alright, so she's just going to let the wave slow push in. But that's fine. Um, if it gets close enough to my tower, I should be good. Nice. Save the cane. Rengar is low on farm. <clears throat> huh. Missed the Q again. Okay, so whatever she's doing now is just silly. <clears throat> the wave's pushing to me anyway. At worst, I would lose like one minion there. So her, <clears throat> her walking up to me to pressure doesn't really mean anything to me. Okay, whatever. I'll get hit by your Q. It's fine. I'm gonna walk away. Oh, nice job, Ari. I've been seeing a lot of Ari's pop off lately. Not sure if that's just like a season 14 thing or if she's strong right now. I do not know where Alawi is, but we are winning the farm game. Let's go. I think I got all those. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna shove this as fast as I can because I think they might be on grubs.
They are not on grubs. Actually, I'm gonna help him. Looks like she's building a hull breaker first, which is, you know, it's fine. I think I get six off of these grubs, maybe? Let's go. Since I shoved the wave in, I can help Kane do this. If Rengar's dumb enough to try this and stop my back. Alright, <clears throat> so first item. That's fine, doesn't matter. Uh, actually, you know what? If she's going to slow push the wave like this, even though it's already shoved under, I'm going to hold my teleport. Because this pushes back to me no matter what. If you shove a wave completely under tower and then you don't touch the minion wave at all, it will eventually end up back under your tower. Uh, the only difference is it's either going to end up there fast or slow, depending on how fast they push. This allow he chose to do it slowly, and so now I miss maybe a couple of minions, but I also got the grub experience, so it's fine. <clears throat> and then I come back to all of this farm. Which is at least 10, I think, so... <sighs> I just did that at the wrong time. Mm. Okay, so we <clears throat> are tied in farm now. We can go for this. <clears throat> I don't like how if it dies while it's casting, it still hits the wave. I think that's a bit silly. Um, we could maybe fight her. If she hits me with E, though. I want her to throw it. If she throws it and misses it, she's gonna get hit hard. I'm gonna just Q her in the face. She missed it, so now I'm gonna go for an all-in. Or I'm gonna bait an all- Okay, see? Even Alawi knows she can't survive that. <laughs> if she doesn't hit E, she's gonna have a terrible, terrible time. As evidenced by her flashing out immediately, I thought she would at least, like, pop her ult or something, but I guess I'm gonna have to hit her. I use geometry, walk at them, then go at a 90 degree angle away from them. Um, it is the quickest way to get out of a skill shot in straight at you. So think about like a giant plus sign. <clears throat> Whatever way you're walking, uh, make a plus sign and walk in that direction. Still missing. Take that, pop my potion. <clears throat> she is not looking too good. And I, please get my minions. I don't think I pinged her Lowey's flash. <clears throat> I'm definitely not going to dive her. That would be really stupid. But, you know what, while I have a moment, I think what I'm gonna- Yeah, see, Rengar was topside. But, I'm still gonna get a ward in here anyway. Maybe not the best ward, but... Okay, allow he teleported back. She is not building a Hullbreaker, at least not first. Oh. I want her to ult me. Ult me! Okay, so she TP'd back, and then immediately took half of her health bar and damage. Not what you want to do if you use teleport. Ow. Alright, now I gotta walk away, but she's shoving the wave. She's chasing me for no reason. Mm, I, don't, I mean, I don't know what that was. <clears throat> the wave's not frozen, she has to walk back to go there. So I'm going to back, buy a sheen, and some boots, and then I'm going to crush her, hopefully. Still all entirely dependent on me not getting hit by her. Mm, that was kind of a waste of a teleport, because she's not pushing, but... Ranger 
Rengar's bot side. Kind of silly by him showing in the bush, or at least they were anticipating he might gank through the lane. So my bot lane just got us grubs again. Make sure I get an assist off of these. Okay. <laughs> Seems like a one for one trade, maybe? Now he has no flash, but she does have ult. So again, she's still quite lethal. She backed just for health. Now she's got a burner. Ult. Good job, Kane. Nice. Beautiful. Now we get to see how Trundle takes towers. <clears throat> we got six grubs too, so obviously that's going to do a lot more damage. But Trundle doesn't really need the grubs to take towers. I can just do that. Dang, I didn't even get an assist for that kill. It's kind of unfortunate. All right, uh, we're gonna get another ward there, so we can see if Rengar comes up here. Uh, he's on his way, but he's about to lose his uh, run. I think I clipped an auto. Yeah, I know, I can see him. <clears throat> oh, by the way, this game, uh, I'm in Emerald 3, Elo. Let me see if I can get Poor Professor up here real quick. Because it's up everywhere else except for this. So, Alawi has level 7 on Alawi, but does not play top. Or at least it it says she does. But I don't think regularly is what it feels like. Use the W to get back to uh, lane faster. Especially since if you put it at the end of the fountain, you just get all your mana back as you pass it. Anyway... Ari, you might have just killed yourself. You definitely did. No? Oh my god. Wow. I think Seraphine may have sacrificed herself. Oh my god. Uh, wow. That is insane. I don't know what Ezreal was looking at there. She might not have her ult back. Okay, she does, but I'm just gonna walk away because she cast it into my bone plating. This is a perfectly acceptable amount of damage to have taken. I think. I'm a lot stronger than her. She might have one full. Alright, what is with these tentacles? Can we not spawn like 30 of them, please? I didn't think she'd have ult back up, but she does. If Rengar's down there and he dies, I can just. Pretty sure I win this in the very... Okay, we got it. Nice. <clears throat> like I said, if she doesn't have that ult, she's not going to do anything. Um, she's just not strong enough without it. Even if she hits her E, like... I feel like a lot of people don't realize that in this season... Uh, I don't want to mess with Rengar. Get away from me, my friend. Damn. Those, I should have hit the tower instead of the minions, but those, um, those towers in the side lanes, if you take them solo, uh, you get like 700 gold, which I think is wild, but I'm not complaining. Team's getting the dragon. It's a nice one. Like that. Invading red, taking it. Rengar doesn't really. I mean, he's three and one, which I didn't. He's all of their kills. Oh. You gotta be careful with Kale, though. I mean, that that champion skills so hard that 
Uh, I don't want to go for this. Actually, yeah, I do. If Rengar comes to me, I think I kill him. Oh, never mind. Rengar's dead, so I don't really need assistance here anymore. That's the only thing I was kind of scared of. Not because I thought I might die to Rengar, but more so because I don't really feel like giving up uh, the Rift for, like, no reason. Get a ton of health back. Go top and collect the wave that's crashing. Everything going real well this game. And this is patch 14.4, which is after the lethal tempo nerves, and it's after Trundle's Q nerve. Can I go down here? Uh, get that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna TP in. I'm gonna make them regret everything. Beta whale. Oh wait, she got charmed. I was gonna say, we definitely don't want to have, like, four people standing on top of a Lowie there. Um, not usually a good idea. I'm gonna just drop the rift. But yeah, <clears throat> if you have that many people standing on top of a Lowie, you should, you might as well run. Not very smart to be there like that. Eh, I don't want to die to Smolder. If only your aim was slightly better there. I'll hit that fist bump, why not? Oh boy. Oh, there goes his jungle camp, though. Um, I don't know, things are going pretty well right now. Maybe I could use the rift a little bit better, but... Gonna go hull breaker second. And if I were to get that within the next like three minutes, um, well, you know, as much as I'd like to say they can't handle my split pressure, this team that we're facing kind of can. Later in the game, like if we were all level 18, Kale would just absolutely melt me if I was trying to split. I might be able to take the tower before she kills me, but I could definitely not take two and I certainly couldn't take the tower and then kill her after it. Oh, he did go blue cane, huh? See, the thing that he's doing right here is a little unwise, because he has no clue who's inside the jungle, which is all of them, and now he's dead. Um, not sure why he would chase after a Lowie of all people trying to one-shot. That's never gonna work. And this is the problem- okay. Janet, get away. This is the problem with, uh... Emerald sometimes, is you get people who get a few kills, and then they think that they're the resurrection of God. Okay, I'll just jump out the way. Wow, that is like a lot of damage just from her E and her, I think her ult. But, is what it is, we're good. I didn't expect Rengar to be sitting in that bush, but... But, uh, he was. I'm not really going to back yet. Um, at least I don't really want to. A little bit more XP off of that. A little bit mix more XP off of that. Take this. If Rengar comes back top, he loses a third dragon, and I don't really think he wants that. Take that wave. We dip. Actually... I see three of them, I don't see Smolder, and I don't see Rengar. So I'll just take 700 gold for free. 
And uh, now I only need a couple hundred gold to get this uh, item. Man, Kane is lucky he's fast. I think if I take this Gromp... Yeah, if I take the Gromp... Alright, alright, you gotta not be a little baby about this. You gotta go for it or you gotta go for it. Like that. Uh, I can sell Dorn's Blade and get the Hullbreaker now. So, I'm very, very strong in a side lane, but I don't know if Kale can... Kale probably can't beat me yet, but she definitely can a little later. Kane really messed up going blue Kane, I think. Um... I just think that was unwise. I know this guy doesn't have flash. Where the hell you think you're going, Rengar? Okay, that was really the only choice he had, was to ult. It's a shame, too. I should have saved the pillar. I didn't really need to use it. I could have just walked right up to him. There's Kale. I don't see any of them on the map, so they could be coming for me. There's Janna and Alawi. Kale's watching that. Okay, good. They could all end up dead here, and it won't matter. Now, we shouldn't. Just dip, guys. Just dip. That is three of them. Kale's over here, but Kale, right now, I can probably just take the tower in front of her. Oh, no. It's not the right tower. We gotta be careful about how we go and, and do this. Kale hits 16, she's gonna be very, very scary, so. We gotta try and end before that. I would love to get level 16. I really hope this isn't warded. I, although I will say. Come on, Kale, come through this jungle. I'm gonna turn on cha uh, target champions only here. If she walks through the jungle, I think I can kill her. Or if she walks up for the next wave. I like my human with a bit of spice. I mean. She's gonna press the thingy. Uh, she's gotta expect that. Like, if they're 1 3 one ing. Okay, at least Kane uh, cleaned her up. So Kale altered there. There's a Lowey. You guys gotta try and get it, like, okay, Kane, you're just being stupid. And honestly, Ari dying there was really bad. Like, insanely bad. I don't know if she just, like, used everything on Alawi and then got Rengar ulted, but she's gotta try and be aware of that. King of Trolls coming through. Okay, now Ari's TPing mid. And I think... Three of them are over there, so they're gonna lose this tower and it. Alright, I'm gonna let them back. But <clears throat> we got something out of it. We should go and take the soul now.
I get 16, that's a pretty decent sized power spike. I don't know what Kane is doing. No, 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 no. Oh, what on earth? That was a lot of damage. So they got the objective. Kane's gonna kill himself, I think. Oh no! I mean, he did. Did we all die? Wow. I just... I died in two seconds. I have no MR, and that's what I'm getting killed by, so... Hmm. I'm gonna buy this so I'm tankier, and then I'll buy that. Alright, so this is exactly what I was afraid of. Uh, who killed me, by the way? Smolder? That's annoying. But Smolder farmed up, and now he's stacked. Um, and remember, this game was 3 kills to 12, so it's been 14 kills to 8 since then. Due to my team, or mostly Kane, really. Just kind of running around getting himself killed for no reason. You can't really do that in this rank. Like, it's not the rank to mess around in. Mistakes will get very, very badly punished. I'm gonna just kind of try and wait in this bush, I think. I think I can fight a Lowie. I think. Mm. I think this wave still crashes on us. This is not that great because I'm topside and Baron's gonna be up. But there's Rengar and he just got picked, so. If they are smart, they will go straight to Baron and get ready. I think they're killing Smolder as well. Uh, that's huge, because now I just like end the game. Lag spike. Nothing you can do about those. They want me to end, but Kale is alive. Like, I'm glad they made the right decision here, because we don't really want to walk up to a Kale that's got that many stacks. Kale is a crazy champion. This ward right here is mostly full health, so that could be the answer to our problems. Stay on this. Oh my god, Smolder, man. How did Rengar do? That much damage, my god. I should not have flashed out that way. I should have flashed out this way and then just TP'd. That would have been way smarter and we probably would have ended the game. So, I kinda... kinda fucked that up, but... Is what it is. Uh, jeez. What does he have, like, armor pen? Lethality? Yeah, hmm. Mm. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna get this, and I'll get a potion, so that I'm much, much stronger. We have two inhibs. We want to get dragon. My god, this is a long commentary. I'm a little annoyed that I let myself get killed there. I don't know why I flashed out that way. That was so stupid. 
And Rengar did 1,600 damage to me just from jumping on my head, which... That's beyond me. Uh, if they aren't careful here, and too many of them try and stop Soul... killer that was. Watch this. We go into town on these, and we... And we win. Alright, so yeah, they can't leave base. If their base is like that, and I have teleport, they're not allowed to leave. Uh, as soon as I saw the Kale, I knew that's what I was going for. Dragon Soul is not worth losing your base. Like, losing your base loses the game. Losing Dragon Soul when you have a Smolder and a Kale on your team... Doesn't really mean much, but um, yeah, that was a pretty good game. I'm glad I got that commentary. I'm going to give it to Ari just because she plays really, really well for the beginning part of the game. And let's see how much LP we get. This this account's had some weird LP. 18, that's, that's not so bad. Let's see, so damage overall, not so bad. Damage to turrets, though, you can see the effect of uh, playing Trundle. All right, man. GG. Um, follow me on Twitch. Follow me on, or subscribe to me on YouTube, like the video if you want, comment, subscribe, whatever standard YouTuber phrase at the end of every video, and I will see you in the next commentary. GG. Peace.